Should have set that a little bit longer, apparently. <laughs> Don't encourage adblock guys, not cool. What's going on with adblock? Oh, Dark must <laughs> Dark must not know we run the commercials when we're in between things, so sorry about that, Dark. People are suggesting adblock. Yeah, people complain about ads. I guess so So people know, yeah, when uh, the ads run whenever I'm setting up a game or whenever, like, I need a short break. So uh, that's why they happen. I wish they wouldn't keep repeating the ads over and over again. That kind of bugs me, but there's nothing I can really do to uh, fix that, sadly. But yes, uh, the ad revenue does help me out. It's a paltry amount very small but every little bit helps so same thing with the uh, with the subscriptions actually when you do the subscription you actually do you are giving me like a little bit of change out of that so a lot of it goes to twitch the rest goes to me and it helps so that's why everyone who's subscribed tonight and gotten their golden eggs thank you so much I'll <laughs> hopefully the uh, emotes will be up tomorrow it would be nice to me actually be able to give you those so there you go. I pay Proton John with my time, literally. All right. So uh, for those of you who are, n oh, Eco, are you? Uh, okay. Well, yeah. <laughs> uh, I will take off ad block when they stop throwing ads on the moment I enter a stream. I can. Fair enough. I can understand that. All right, so for those who are new to stream, uh, usually at the end I just hang out a bit, mess around with the the gifts I have going on, on the intermission screen, and chat with you guys and ask questions. So if anyone's got any questions or want to chat, let's go. Wow, still talking, such opinion. I don't know why, but I love that Shiba meme for some reason. I don't know why I I like it. Like, there's very few memes I actually like, and the the Shiba Doge one is one, and 60 Spider Man's the other. So. What's your favorite topping for pizza? Brooklyn pepperoni. If you're the proton, John, then who's the electron and neutron? I killed them. They will never speak again. What is that Resident Evil 5 gift supposed to be? Uh, that is a flock of crows, but all the crows have been replaced with Wesker. So it's a flock of Weskers. How do you like your meat? Uh, medium well. Random question. Have you ever played or heard of a game called Illbleed for the Dreamcast? Uh, I was actually at my friend's place the other day, and we were playing them the weird jumping minigame in Illbleed, but I've never actually played Illbleed itself. I am aware of the existence of Illbleed, though. Have you the rock rubbing his belly gif? No, I do not. John, my girlfriend had to go to bed and couldn't save the rest of the stream. Disappointed. Ouch. Sorry to hear that. I'll, gi I'll give you a disappointed just for that one. Disappointed! John, have you ever played the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle arcade game? Yes, I have. Both in arcades and at home. Because it's on Xbox Live, or at least it was. So, yeah. No, I've beaten it. I think there's actually videos of it on uh, Rodney, Azure Blade 49's channel. Is there a bad Mario Party game? Um, from what everyone tells me, the Game Boy Advance Mario Party is not very good. Have you seen Kung Pao yet? No. Last time I met it with Jake, we didn't do it. When can we play Worms Armageddon again, John? Uh, Chaos, I am not sure. I have the internet connection to play it again, but I just have not had a chance to actually sit around and do it again. We'll see. Do you have a copy of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Tournament Fighters for the SNES, NES, or Genesis? Uh, I believe I have all three, actually. I know I have the NES and SNES ones. Pretty sure the Genesis one's back there, too. I don't. My Genesis games aren't in alphabetical order, so I can't check with a glance. Dear Proton John, do you own any old instruction booklets of older games? I actually have the majority of my instruction booklets from the games I had when I was a kid. 
So there's a drawer here I have in storage somewhere that has uh, the manuals like Super Mario RPG, Donkey Kong Countries 2 and 3, uh, Super Mario Land, Tetris, Kid Icarus and Miss and Monsters, like old games like that. So I've got a bunch. John, we never get PC Resident Evil 5 for online things or hacking. You know what? I kind of want to get it for hacking. It would really make doing the Rotten Egg Challenge a, a hell of a lot easier. John, what killed the Ice Age? The dinosaurs, obviously. Why would you think otherwise? What game do you consider to be a prized possession? Uh, I Probably the most expensive one I have is Panzer Dragoon Saga. That's And it's in really good condition. I think it's graded as an 8, I think is what I got for quality. So it's worth a couple hundred. John, Robert Cup? Robert Cup. What is the Rotten Egg Challenge? Okay, for those who don't know the Rotten Egg Challenge, uh, in Resident Evil 5, there's an item you can get called Rotten Egg. If you throw it at an enemy and it hits, it does a thousand damage. So there's a way to duplicate the item so you have a ton of them. And uh, during the Resident Evil 5 LP I did with Jake, we... I, uh... I talked about the Rotten Egg Challenge, which is basically you go through a stage of Resident Evil 5 and your only weapon is Rotten Eggs. That's the only way you can kill enemies. So on Sunday night, uh, during the live stream, what we did was I took on Wesker with just Rotten Eggs. That video is actually posted on my YouTube channel, so you can watch that on YouTube and see how well that went. Nothing can kill the Robert Cup. What's your favorite old cartoon? Samurai Pizza Cats. I also really like Inspector Gadget. Have you played any Hotline Miami? No, I have not. I've just listened to the soundtrack. But I do have a copy of it. John, have you played Double Dragon Neon? I have beaten Double Dragon Neon. I really liked it. Hey, John, how do I get Senpai to notice me? Uh, and talk to him. That's a good way to do it. John, would you like to da 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 duel? Uh, no, I don't have my Yu-Gi-Oh cards on me right now. Uh, John, when is Superman 64 coming out? It came out in 1999. Uh... The LP, on the other hand, uh, I don't know. I'm going to start working on it again this week or so. Hopefully soon. I have no proper day for it. John, will you have a panda peach emote? Um, there are no current plans for it, but we'll see. The more subscriptions I get, the more emotes I'm allowed to have. That's how Twitch works. So I think right now I'm allowed to have four emotes. And uh, the ones I'm adding will be uh, Robert, yeah, Waluigi Cop, and I think Fortune Cookie was the other one I was going to add tomorrow. Or maybe I'll add Disappointed. I don't know which one I'll add first. We'll figure it out. I know Robert Cop's getting in there. That's a good Neon Knight Riders gift that you sent me, Blue Eyes. Not quite sure why you sent it to me, but it's nice. John, have you played Anti-Chamber? No, I have not. I don't think John likes Pokemon. Uh, not really, but I have debated getting the new Pokemon. Uh, I'm not going to lie. Because I've heard it's a bit more easier to play. Not easier to play. Faster to play. So I've been thinking about maybe. We'll, we'll see in the future. We shall see. Puppet Master's linking a gift. These are always good. Happy birthday to the crowd! <laughs> I threw the rest of the cake, too! Welcome to the real world, jackass! Alright, that's pretty good. I like that. What did Patrick say? John, are you a pedophile? No. Fuck no. I had a good one I was going to throw up here last time. Get some Megatron some love there. It's just wondering, so I'm sure you were wondering, fucker. <laughs> you watch the videos that Pro Jared has on his channel if you're curious about XY. I'd rather go in and just play it. Honestly. But I don't have the money that I want to be spending towards that. I Like, right now, my, my frivolous game choice right now is between the new Batman game 
and Pokemon, and right now Batman easily wins that fight. John, what's your favorite animal or Pokemon? I want to draw you with them. Uh, favorite animal is a Samurai Pizza Cat, <laughs> and favorite Pokemon is Hitmonlee. John, have you ever thought about creating your own game? Uh, I've worked on a game before for university. Not my thing. Maybe, w maybe with an engine like Unity or something a bit more easier to handle, but core just flat out programming myself, I'd rather not. <laughs> Seeing the Samurai Pizza Cats theme. Samurai Pizza Cats! Oh yeah! Who do you call when you want some pepperoni? Samurai Pizza Cats! Right on! They're stomping out crime, and you know that ain't baloney. The speedy ceviche, he's the leader of the bunch. A heck of a fight makes a heck of a lunch. And little polyester. Oh, that's where I forget it. Not bad, I'm impressed I remember that much. Haven't even seen that show in a while. John, when will you finally admit your true love towards Chugga? Never, because I don't have any true love. I like boobs too much to like Chugga in that way. What kind of non-TRG collabs can we expect in the future? Some more Gerard? Uh, maybe if Gerard ever wants to do something. And don't quit your j day job to sing. Keep in mind that song is one of those ones that's just, like, super weird and not really singable. The kind of songs I usually sing are, uh, I guess, more punkish in nature. Or, like, Muse. I think uh, there was a couple streams ago someone got me to sing a part of Time is Running Out. And I... How does that go again? I think I'm drowning, asphyxiated. I want to break the spell that you've created. You're something beautiful, a contradiction. And that's the part I can't remember. Then it's like, I won't let you smother it. Because our time is running out. No time is running out. Can't push it underground. And I can't remember the lyrics. It's been a long time. Zero out of ten. Stop, John. One ten. We'll listen to again. Wow, everyone's a everyone's a fucking critic tonight. Very Burton was here, he would say, what is this? That's true. He also sang this song in a Bruno Mario LP of yours. Um, I don't think it was Bruno Mario. It was one of those. It was Enigmatic Mario, the one that got removed from my channel. Better than I've heard any other LP -er I've heard sing, but not great. You know what? No, I... <laughs> I'm better. I'm I'm better at harmonizing than I am with proper singing. That's what I'd say. So if I had the music playing in the background, it would sound better. But at the same time, I mean, what do you expect? Like then it masks the the bad parts of the singing. John John Tron can like operatic sing. He can sing opera style. So yeah, he is by far a better singer than I am. John, when are you going to start playing something, and what are you going to start playing? Uh, we're done for the night, dude. We're just doing Q&A, and then we're done. So I'm going to turn off uh, not playing now, because we finished Trails in Time. John, what kind of features will you give to subscribers that will entice me to pay my hard-earned money? Um, the golden egg! <laughs> no, the egg, uh, there's... Emotes that will be going up in the next couple days. I'm kind of bummed out that they weren't available for this stream. There's going to be doing... Blah, blah, blah. There'll be every now and then there'll be a fortune cookie stream where anyone who's a subscriber gets to choose what I play. And they can just flat out say what game they want me to play. So they basically get to control the streams at certain points. So <laughs> as dangerous as that sounds, it'll be funny. And that's probably one of the better things I'll be able to give to streamers. Also, if we get enough people, and or if the chat becomes garbage, we can just turn on subscriber chat. So then you guys can be nice and peaceful. But I'm not going to do that tonight, because I'd be a dick to do that tonight. When are you going to do that blind stream? I assume you mean Dead Space. Um, sometime this week, maybe? I don't know. My, my Thursday is busy. 
Yeah, my Thursday's busy, my Friday's busy, my Saturday's busy. Wednesday's the only day that I might not be busy, and even then that's 50 50 because I'm supposed to be going out with some friends for wings. So it depends on if we're doing that tomorrow or not. So if uh, if that's the case, if we don't, if I don't go out anywhere tomorrow night, there might be the Dead Space Blind stream tomorrow. We'll see. John has a new place. Really good, actually. I really like it. I haven't got everything up. Like, none of my posters are up yet. But everything's hooked up and good to go, so it's comfortable to live in, but not perfectly homey yet. Hey, John, which faction did you back in Fallout New Vegas? I am so behind on Fallout, I have not played New Vegas yet. And my copy is currently loaned out to a friend. I hope chat does not spoil Dead Space at the time. And we'll see. What, I don't know what there is to spoil. I already know the twist ending, sadly. So, But anyways, if I do do the blind stream like soon, and any mods will have the right to ban people, or sorry, time out people who give spoilers during the playthroughs. So let's put it that way. Mods will have... Who is texting me at 2 a.m.? Gee, you fucker, you're listening to this stream, aren't you? <laughs> Fine, G. I guess we're not going out for wings. I guess I'm doing Dead Space tomorrow. <laughs> okay, that's pretty funny. That's pretty fucking funny. Uh, for the <laughs> Sorry. Uh, every Wednesday, I usually go out my buddy G. Uh, we usually go for out for wings. Or we've done that in the past couple weeks. And uh, he listens to the streams every now and then. And apparently he's listening right now. <laughs> Because he just texted me saying, "Yeah, dude, just play house, just do Dead Space tomorrow." <laughs> so I guess we're not going out for wings. Or he's coming over, and then we're gonna just stream it. I don't know. We'll figure that out tomorrow. Uh, G has shown up in a cup, one or two of my videos. I think he did narration for one of the Master System episodes. Pretty sure he did that. And he was uh, in an episode of uh, Metroid, Metroid, yeah, Super Metroid Mega Boss Battles. He just was kind of hanging out in the background chatting with me. Do I have siblings? Uh, yes, I have a sister and a half-brother. Both are older than me. I am the youngest child. Has there ever been a moment in TRG where you guys started recording and after a while you realized the game wasn't going to work out for an LP? G says he is terrible at narration. I am terrible, says G. As in he is. Thank, thank you for clarifying that. <laughs> John, help me get to Lethbridge, please. My fiance would love it. Are you stuck here in town or something? Or Dodge it like the Matrix. Yes, that's exactly what he said, Miles. Judge the narration for yourself. Man, Miles is on the ball tonight. How's Moses? Uh, he's doing good. John, who is Nodj? Oh, my evil twin. John, how does TRG choose a game for an LP? Uh, usually if it's a game that one of us likes, we'll suggest it. And if everyone likes it, we go for it. Or if we have a special guest, they get to suggest a game. So our next special guest suggested the game, and that's what we're going to play. John, I've seen several Twitch users do a subscriber night where they play online multiplayer games with subscribers picked from a random list. Would you consider doing that sometime? That's actually a pretty good idea, Valerian. I think we should do that. We just need to find a game that we can mutually agree on and then make sure that's only the subs that we're playing with and not uh, the random chat. John, is our Castle Crashers playthrough now void? Um, I still have my save my character. I don't know about you, dude. It's more a problem finding the free time to actually play through it. <laughs> How fast your fans found that video is scary. But to be fair, it's not like it's that hard to find. You already said what series it was. 
Can we get a hint on the next TRG player four? The hint I was about to give would have been way too obvious. Um. Oh, you can send Twitch PMs to only your subs. Makes it easier to organize stuff quietly. Yeah, thank you, Patrick. I appreciate that. I, I want to give special thanks to Patrick, by the way. So he's the one who basically got me the push to go for the sub button. And it worked. So thank you so much, Patrick, for that. I owe you for that one. And once I can actually uh, get some space on my credit card, I will subscribe to you. Because since you've had the button, my credit card has been way over, way too full. So, John, you have a favorite Castlevania? If so, which one is it? <laughs> Dude, upgrade your credit card's hard drive. Uh. Aria of Sorrow is probably my favorite Castlevania. P call for president. Once I get any money, I'm going to sub you both. I'm trying to get the completion of the sub button. Gerard got denied for his sub button, and we're, no one's really sure why, because he's got better numbers than we do, technically. We just happen to stream more. And I guess that's why. Oh, well, that worked great. Good job, John. I'm glad you added that one and then immediately removed it. Ivory Hammer, thank you very much for subscribing. Once we have emotes available, we will give, we'll do something. I think what we'll do is one of the emotes is going to be an egg so I think what we'll do is when anyone subscribes we'll give them an egg it makes sense right I mean that's what Wesker's all about you will give me an egg sub hype how has your family reacted to your internet popularity I haven't told them to put it bluntly uh, what I've told them will be is something different I, I, they know that I do this stuff online but they don't know how big it is, I guess. So, I just, I just tell them that's yeah, my hobby. John, if you respond to the last thing I said, I missed it because my charger likes to pop out a laptop at random points. I didn't notice it before the die. Then when I got back on my internet, it's fast. Also, kind of get it disappointed for that. Uh, you'll get whatever this button does. That works. Apparently my... That, that's what happens when I press the one button on my laptop. So John, where would that hint be for the next player four? It's someone you'd expect to be our player four. There's your hint. Have you played the wonderful 101 at all after the freeze? No, I did not. My Wii U froze on a bunch of other things, so I think it's my Wii U and not necessarily Wonderful 101. Which N64 Bomberman games have you played? Uh, Bomberman 64, the second attack, is the only one I've actually completed. The other two I've played a bit. Actually, no, I've never played Bomberman Hero, so I didn't, but I've played a bit of Bomberman 64, the original. That song was not Paris by Moon, that's Hydrogen by Moon. I knew it! Player 4 is Proton John! Yes, you've learned the secret. My left hand will be playing Player 4 while my right hand plays Player 3. Can we expect an LP of Second Attack? Uh, probably not. I don't know if I could go back to that game. I don't like the the 3D Bombermans on the N64. My, my preference is the 2D ones. Will you still love me if I can't become a sub? Yes. But don't tell anyone else. If they know my secret, then they'll never subscribe. <laughs> Luca, you should join me. Honestly, if Luca's back for another uh, Runaway Guys LP, it'll be Little Big Planet 2. And based on the reaction to the first one, I don't know when that'll happen. It'll probably be just 
something casual. <laughs> we'll, we'll find out in six months to two years. Uh, the next player for LP will probably be up sooner than six months. Probably more like two? Two sounds right, I think, actually. Okay, what exactly is your Wii U? Keep freezing. The Wii U browser, Netflix, just various games is where it locked up. It's locked up tw uh, once in DuckTales Remastered and once in Wonderful 101. And I think once in Mario or Nintendo Land. I can't remember what it was. So Big Planet caused so much drama for no good reason at all. Because Lucagen has boobs. That is pretty much it. Because anytime there's a girl on the internet, it causes problems, and I don't fucking know why. Uh, we read the comments together, and it was just the dumbest thing. Yeah, coffee. Twelve-year-old boys. There are girls on the internet? What? It's women in video games. What? Did, wait, what did SSJ2 beat you to? Oh, there are girls on the internet. Oh. Boobs! I found Patrick's favorite word. Boobs are the shit y'all just hate us. Boobs are amazing. I don't think anyone here will actually uh, say no to that. Anyone who says no to boobs is not a person. Not a human being at all. The robot must be destroyed. So, so boobs. Wow, such women. <laughs> we have a lot of boobs. <laughs> or is gay. Well, I guess. If Yeah, if it's a guy liking only guys, then yeah, that would make sense. My favorite word is circumvent. My favorite things are boobs. So you like the circumvent boobs? That's weird, dude. Favorite rare game. Um, uh hmm. Connect Sports. Uh, that's actually a very good question. What would be my favorite rare game? On the N64, probably Perfect Dark. So I think Perfect Dark will probably be my answer. Boobs make Chenzo happy. Everyone has boobs. Men just call them pecs. These are all fairly true things. Pommy ap appreciates your commitment. <laughs> okay, here's what's going up next. I'll, re I'll remove the horse to replace it with this one. Oh, the slow motion makes it even better. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. Good job. Good job, Spider-Man. <laughs> Have you played Kingdom Hearts? What are your thoughts on the franchise? <laughs> Sorry, I keep looking at that gift. <laughs> uh, I've only played the first one. I liked it, but I never finished it. I stopped at Neverland. I don't know. I've just never really gotten around to continuing the series. <laughs> 